This is the second half of a two-part series. In case you didn't see the last part, the gimmick here is that I have to complete all of Subnautica with just a Seamoth as my vehicle. And if you haven't seen the first part, you should probably go watch it. I guarantee nothing is going to make sense if you don't. I don't know, do what you want. Last time, I did essentially everything that you do in the early game. I have fully upgraded my Ford F-150 here. It has all the things that it could possibly get. There is just one glaring problem. While I have spent all of my time upgrading the Seamoth, I haven't really spent my time upgrading me, the player. I still have a radiation suit. I still have, you know, the regular fins. I still have the 135 seconds of oxygen when I have this nice, precise installation that lets me get upgraded versions of all three of those things. Actually, I get the reinforced dive suit for the fabricator but just don't worry about that first thing we're gonna do is get more oxygen because i'm so sick and tired of the oxygen in this game it's absolutely annoying just one problem though i don't have uh, a lot of lithium and you know you kind of need lithium for the ultra high capacity tank that's a problem but it's a problem i can fix by probably just going to the mushroom forest or something found a cave over here just filled to the brim with shale out crops i love this game um um, um, okay, I have enough time. You know, maybe I should actually bring my Seamoth to the place I'm going to be exploring. Oh, never mind, I have four lithium. Okay, we're done. Fun fact, I woke up this morning feeling like complete shit, and I think my allergies are back. So if my commentary gets increasingly deranged and delusional, that's probably why. I think whenever I'm sick is when my commentary gets the most deranged. That seems to be a common theme. Now, ultra glide fins. Oh, 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 we need more lithium. We're setting off on another lithium gathering mission once again and i think i'm gonna go ahead and get blood oil for this guy at the same time because it's just efficient to get multiple things don't mind the fact that i did not get extra lithium even though i clearly needed it hey hey bone sharks you want to piss off maybe can you do that for me just trying to look for shale out crop you guys are being so greedy Oh, and it was diamonds. Fun, fun, fun. It's almost like that's the exact opposite of what I'm looking for. I'm saying that even though the reinforced dive suit I'm trying to get as well also needs diamonds, but just don't worry about it. There we go. Hey, and a stasis rifle. You know what? That is useful. That is something I'm probably going to end up needing. Just considering the part where I have to go through the inactive lava zone by myself without a vehicle. You know, that might be a good investment to make. There we are. That's something we can make now. All right. Now, we just need to get a metric fuck ton of blood oil. I just need to use the tried and true method of shocking anything that gets remotely close to me, and we'll be okay. And for some reason, there's just bone sharks here to greet me as well, because, you know, just why not? Oh, there's a reef back on the surface. You know, I wonder, can I jump my Seamoth over a reef back? Just in case I get my Seamoth stuck, I am going to save, because I really want to see if I can do this. Okay. Everybody, I think I got this. And spacebar. Oh, he is way wider than I thought. I <laughs> just barely made it. Oh, <laughs> uh, and he sunk below the surface, so I can't even try it again. Well, okay then. <laughs> Not sure what I was expecting there. There we go, ultra glide fins. Maybe I should have gotten the swim charge fins, actually. You know, because I keep running out of power on all of my tools. Um, we don't really need swim charge fins. Nah, we're fine. Just gonna pray that this decision does not bite me in the ass. Yes, <laughs> reinforced dive suit. Now all the damage is like halved, which is perfect. Aurora, we're approaching the planet. Oh, okay. Exactly. I think I'm gonna go to the That's island now. Okay, we got people coming to save us. I'm gonna go to the landing site and we'll totally get rescued, right? It's too early in the game to get rescued, but it's fine. Have no fear. There's still gonna be useful stuff on this island for us. Oh, oh, oh. God damn it. Now you may be wondering, but why do those little piranha things scare you so much? It's because they come out of nowhere, and I'm a big doofus. You should have gathered that by now. Purple tablet? Another purple tablet? I think we're good enough to go into this damn base. I'm just gonna jump down. I do have a reinforced dive suit. Okay, that was actually more health than I was expecting. I should stop doing that. You know, I've been trying to come up with a good bit about this whole base, but... I just can't. Truth is, I've been playing so much of this game, I have nothing interesting to say about the base anymore. Or that might just be my allergies chipping away at my sanity. You know, whichever one works. Oh! I already said I should stop doing that. Why did I keep doing that? That was a complete accident. <laughs> I swear. 
I have zero urges to actually watch the Summoning Explode, because let's be honest, nobody cares. We're just gonna set off and continue with our duties, okay? And I actually have an idea of where to go next. I want to go to those, um, Sanctuary Caches, because they have a ton of Ion Cubes that I can use. You know, I kind of need them to beat the game anyways, so it's all good. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that kind of scared me. Okay. You damaged my Ford F-150, sir. Need to, you know, get some insurance file on this guy, because I am a Ford F-150 owner. All right, I just made like a, a million dollars from that insurance fraud. So now we're going to go to the sanctuary caches. Committing insurance fraud as a Ford F-150 owner really is just an infinite money glitch. All right, well, here's the first cache. <laughs> I found that in like four minutes. We're doing well. Yes, yeah, steal the valuables of the native species like a, um, I don't know, something topical and funny. There was going to be a bit there, but I can't really think right now. All right, off to the second sanctuary cache now. This one's going to be in the dunes, I believe. So going to have to be a little bit more careful for this one. Ooh, I think I found it. I did. I did. I did. Awesome. Why does that Reaper sound really close to where I am? You know what? Not going to question it. I'm just going to grab my stuff and go, okay? What the f***? Oh, oh, no, no, never mind, never mind, never mind. That scared me so fucking bad. Oh, no, oh, never mind. Okay, oh my god, I'm running at like 250 beats a minute right now. No, that's a bad Reaper Leviathan. That's a bad Reaper. <laughs> oh my god. That legitimately freaked me out because I wasn't expecting to hear as close, Rar bullshit. My hands are shaking, man. I, I, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, I think I'm safe now. I think. Okay, I mean, whatever. I'm just gonna make the stasis rifle now. Two times magnetite. I guess I'm going out to get more shit. There's some magnetite. Yes. Diamonds. Gold. Yes. Give me all your riches. Start to think magnetite just doesn't exist down here. I found one and then I just, they all just disappeared. <laughs> like what? Oh, f*** you. You're going to put magnetite into a drillable like that. I don't have the prawn suits. This game is openly mocking me. You know what? Forget this. I'm going to go back up and just watch this dummy explode. About to be the light show of the century over here. And you're gone. Okay, nice knowing you, buddy. Oh, never mind. I had magnetite back at my um, life pod. <laughs> Joy. Okay, now what, what do you mean? I'm just, I'm just trying to get outcrops. I'm just trying to find some copper. I'm just stealing resources from your home, greedy bitch. Well, who cares? We have our stasis rifle. Yes, yes, my one line of defense against the bastards that dwell down in the lava zones. All right, yeah, the Lost River. Yeah, that's a thing. All right, we're in the Lost River. Oh, joy. Oh, heavenly joy. I'm just gonna get you out of my way right now. Why am I even coming down here? Oh, yeah, disease research facility. Hey, hey, you. Yeah, piss off, sir. Piss off. If it wasn't obvious already, I do not like Warpers. Yeah, I mean, I know a horrifying disease is taking over my body, but also, look at this big boy over here. So is there anything, like, actually in here? This is just gonna be a big skeleton. So here's the gay plan. The game plan? Did I say gay plan? Here's the game plan. We are going to go back up to the life pod. We're gonna make a, some more purple tablets, because you need two of them to get into the thermal plant. We're gonna go through the inactive lava zone. We're gonna swim through by ourselves, okay? It's fine. Gonna go to the thermal plant. We're gonna get the blue tablet. We're gonna go back up, get some kyanite, make another blue tablet. We're gonna go back through the lava zone, say hi to the sea emperor, and then, you know, make those hatching enzymes and hopefully not get attacked by a big old ghost leviathan. That would be so awesome if we weren't attacked by a ghost leviathan. He's going for the walls. It's all good. You go for the walls because you're a stupid fish. It brings me so much joy seeing a reaper skeleton down here reapers have given me a lot of heartache i really don't like those guys oh geez okay hello there and i have to go get another diamond so i can make the second purple tablet that i need joy okay i'm making a second blue tablet or purple tablet god damn it i'm delusional and i'm just gonna put you in there so i don't like you know lose you i think we're good enough to go into the actual damn lava zone this time now is probably a very good time to make an extra oxygen tank because i am about to go through an entire biome 
without any vehicles. Yes, we only make smart decisions here, okay? I'm gonna make it a lightweight high capacity tank actually because because I don't know if it's gonna slow me down when it's in my inventory, but I do not want to take that risk. There's no need to question my decision making skills, you know, it's just don't worry about it. I was kind of hoping that you would take up less space in my inventory though. You know, just would have been kind of nice. I'm fully prepared for this to go very badly, but there is a chance that I can make it through. Hello, giant cove tree. It's very good to see you again. So I guess this is where I'm stopping. <laughs> and I'm going to be taking all of these things. Okay, we're going. You know, I don't really have any time to just, you know, be fancy. We're just heading straight down. You know, there is just one problem. Holy crap. Hey, guys. Hey, you really don't need to come after me. That scared me so fucking bad. Yeah, I really don't like this game anymore. I really do not like this game anymore. Oh, God damn it. Where am I? 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 Okay, so you know what? It's fine. I just have to stay away from the, you know, robotic aliens that can shoot warp balls at me, okay? I just have to do that. Wow, that scared me. You know, I just do not like this game anymore. That legitimately gave me an adrenaline rush. Okay, well, there's a dragon at least. Fucking hell, this sucks! Stop! Okay, make it made it into the lava castle. We're all right. Definitely not extremely shocked that I didn't die on the way over here, especially when I got warped. Okay, we made it in. <laughs> that was legitimately terrifying. Okay, just gonna get my air back. Going to put a tablet into here so we can get the blue tablet. Okay, you know what? It's fine. We avoided the warpers, kind of at least. And we avoided the big, huge dragon who can breathe fire at us. Thank we're doing very well for ourselves. I'm actually going to open up this portal and go back up to the surface so I can head over to my life pod and, you know, build a second blue tablet. We're going to be smarty pants for this playthrough. Only good decision making happens on this channel. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, I make terrible decisions. Okay, got our blue tablet. Just gonna put some ion cubes in here because I feel like I'm carrying just a bit too many. Normally, by this point, I would have taken a break and gotten off to do other things, but not this time. I am completing this dumb challenge today just so I can say I did it. I'm not letting this stupid game defeat me, okay? I control the game and the game does not control me. I'm going to make a second ultra high capacity tank because I just discovered the lightweight tank doesn't change anything if you just have a sea glide. It only changes stuff if you're swimming like without one. So it was completely pointless to get that. You know, while I'm here, I'm just gonna, yeah, make things slightly better for me. Here we go. So two ultra high capacity tanks should do me. That should be all I need. I think we're kitted out to head down into the lava lakes and, you know, show that sea dragon bastard who's boss. It's time to head back to the thermal plant and we're going to go for the mountain island again. And we are heading out of here. Time to go. What in the testes? Okay. God. You didn't even give me a minute to get out of the damn lava castle. You calm down, sir. Okay, but if there's anything I've learned about this, is that you stay low to the ground. We just have to avoid the big dragon, you know, that's trying to breathe fire at us. It's fine. I'm not scared out of my mind. What do you mean? Okay, we're going to an even worse area now. Okay, we're in the lava lakes now. Sea dragon, no clue where he is. And you know, honestly, I just don't care at this point. Please make it to the containment facility without dying. I would love you for that, Riley. Ah, there we go. I'm gonna put my tablet in here. At least we made it. <laughs> my sea moth is still all the way back at the, <laughs> at the cove tree biome. I'm such a bad parent. I don't have a vehicle to, you know, accompany me this time, so it's gonna be you and me. Okay, you, you know what? I'm just gonna, you know, do all the Empress stuff. I really have nothing to commentate on. This is the exact same thing we've been doing for like a month now. There, there you go. Now it's time to go find the hatching enzymes. Find the hatching enzymes, make the hatching enzymes. You can tell I'm getting delusional because of these allergies. Also, remember last time whenever I was struggling to find the sea crown? Yeah, me too. There was one down here the entire time. I could have just gone and gotten that one. Okay, yep. Hatching enzymes, get ghost weed, whatever the hell. I have like no time to be fancy at all. I'm just trying to beat this game, okay? Oh, okay. Okay, sir. Is there any reason you have to be here? Okay, we're just gonna leave that guy here. He's just gonna, you know, stand over there. I have no clue why he's there. I have no clue what business he has over there. 
but we're just not gonna worry about it. Ah, good old Cragfield and I stalk. Easy. You know, I like never go to this biome. <laughs> it's there's no point of going over here. There's nothing in there. It's infested with bone sharks everywhere. There's actually just no incentive to go to the crack field like at all. Like wowie, a hellscape filled with bone sharks and nothing else. I wish there was some kind of incentive to go to the crack field, but there isn't. So, okay, we went through the mushroom forest portal and now we're just going to go to the life pod because the mushroom forest is very close to the life pod and we're going to go make these hatching enzymes all right well there's our hatching enzymes I'm getting some more coral samples because i just keep running out of water i'm running out of water in real life too i'm actually like insanely thirsty be right back i'm gonna go and get some water <sighs> no longer thirsty and we're just going to set off for the containment facility again okay well i mean here you go I expect payment in Enzyme 42. I don't just go around doing this stuff for free, okay? You realize how long it takes to forage for the, that many plants? This is the second time I've done this. I've done both sequences at the same time. It's actually kind of loud. Yo, Warper, guess what? You can't do shit to me anymore. I'm normal, not infected, idiot. You know what? That Warper didn't even do anything to me, but you know what? I just kind of hate all of them now because they scare me so fucking badly. All right, you know what? Just suck a big dick. This is what you get for shooting down my friends. Yes, pay for your crimes. Okay, so we have to go back out into the lava zone first to, you know, get back to my sea moth. But I also need to go to the thermal plant so I can get some more kyanite. Oh, wait, I'm stupid. Oh, my God. I was in the quarantine enforcement platform. I opened a portal from the enforcement platform to the thermal plant. Whoopsies. Okay, we just need to pay for my crimes then. Yep, that's the sound of the stupid sea dragon that I could have avoided completely if I just took the thermal plant's warp gate. Okay, well, you know what? Whatever. It's time to pay for my foolishness, I guess. Ah, there he is. Yeah, you know, if you could just, like, not come after me, that would be awesome. We just have to avoid the gigantic dragon that could refire at us. Or just, you know, do that. So how much kyanite do I need? God, I have no idea. Five? Maybe five? Five? I'm gonna go with five. All right, we're just slowly making our way through. I think I saw the dragon somewhere up there, so we're- we should be okay. Are you aiming that at me? Okay, no, okay, you know what? No, 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 f that, f that, f that, f that. You know what? I have no clue if they're after me or not, but I'm just not going to wait and find out. And can my Ford F-150 just shut up? I got it. I also don't know how much sulfur I need, but you know, probably more than three, so ow. You know, as a wise fish from a certain movie once told me, you just gotta keep swimming, okay? I think it was Dory or something. I don't know, can't remember. All right, throwing this out. Let's see what we need for the rocket because I just keep forgetting. Ah, yes, a bunch of shit. You know, it's even worse is the fact that I stockpiled basically nothing this entire time. Yeah, this is going to take a while. Just going to stick you right there. You know, hold up. I wonder, I wonder, it's going to be kind of funny. It didn't kill me? What? Okay, I am very surprised by that. How did that not kill me? Oh, but what it did do, what it did do was kind of just permanently alter the way this is going to be positioned. That is kind of funny. Okay, well, whatever. We're just gonna go with it. <laughs> that is kind of funny. It's just half of it is just in the water. And that was all the result of my attempted suicide let's go find some lithium now okay you know what people have told me that it is very easy to get copper off of these guys by breaking these things yes you guys are like copper machines oh so much copper why didn't i just do this before man i'm dumb well now i know stealing from reef packs is the only way forward i got that now we have everything for the gantry time to take my seam off and just head over there i like how the platform just never corrected itself like been a while since i got crushed by it it's still in this position so it's just gonna stay like that well okay okay we have everything we can go build the I don't even know the name of this part. The Neptune Boosters, yeah. Let's go build the Neptune Boosters. So is the platform ever going to correct itself or is it just stuck like this? I don't know. All I know is that there's some water in the in the space for the ship. Ah, it should be fine though. Neptune Fuel Reserves, this one, you know, sucks, but thankfully we, we just got a shit ton of kyanite and sulfur, it's fine. You know, something I found to be pretty funny is to just charge up my um, defense system and just kind of like, fry everything within a 
30 foot radius. Like, just everything here is dead now. <laughs> Gave me a lot of food, though, so, you know, we'll take that. Okay, let's just leave the graveyard of fish behind. I'm getting so good at this. It's almost like I'm repeating the same group of monotonous tasks a third time around. All right, this is the one that we need the Cyclops for. Pretty sure I don't have the plans for the Cyclops. Yeah, I don't, but I'm pretty close. I have the whole blueprint and I have the bridge blueprint, so we're close. We just have to get the engine blueprint and I know exactly where to find it. So just don't worry about it, okay? It's oh, you want to be that way, huh? Okay, I can oblige. Next time someone's invading your personal space, just fry them like that, okay? All right, <laughs> there's the Cyclops. Let's get it. Let's get out of here and make it. Oh, yep, yep, yep. That is a horrifying recipe. Good God. There we go. Finally. We got the Cyclops. That only took me like 41 years. Just no need to worry about it. Oh, yeah. Ingredients unknown. Luckily, I do think I know where to get this blueprint. I think I know where it is. Yep. <laughs> so good at this. It's good to be smarty pants once in a while. Yo, a time capsule. What do you got for me? It's just a bunch of snacks. Cool. Okay. Oh, um. Oh, okay. We are going to forget about that now. All right. Well, we have the blueprint for the shield generator. Time to go and make it. I thought I was done with this stupid biome. I guess not. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, you. Hey, you. Just stand there, okay? Just stand there. Once again, this is not cheating. Unless I use the Cyclops for anything other than making the shield generator. In which case, that is cheating. Uh, just, just don't worry about it, okay? I kind of need this to actually complete the game. That's the only way you can get the shield generator. All right. Well, now that we got that, time to build the final component. Oh, hey, look, reef backs are about to hit my Cyclops again. How joyous. There, 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 it's done. My, my listing rocket is finally completed. My low budget SpaceX project. Finally, it's freaking finished. I'm so done with Subnautica. I care nothing for this save file anymore. I'm going to go find a Reaper and feed my seam off to it. Hey, hey, you, do you want my seam off? Here, take it, dude. Just take my seam off. Take it, dude. There you go. For the first time ever, I'm not like actively trying to avoid you. I just kind of left it over there with a reaper. I'm a terrible parent. Okay, well, whatever. See you later, my Ford F-150. My Seamoth is still over there. The Reaper didn't even destroy it. I was kind of thinking that the uh, beacon would have disappeared by now, but no. I mean, shit, it's not my problem. I just kind of was thinking I'd give it a quick death, but I guess not. Cyclops, on the other hand, it's going to ride here forever. All right, I do not care about the time capsule. I just want this to end. I'm just going to enjoy it. I'm no, done. Okay. There we go. Yes. Oh. So considering this is like the last like only vehicle challenge thing, Let's compare time. So I got seven hours, nine minutes on the Seamoth, seven hours, 45 minutes on the prawn suit, and eight hours, 56 minutes on the Cyclops. That makes sense because Seamoth, I had to spend less time searching wrecks trying to find blueprints for the upgrades. Yeah, I'm done. Goodbye.